Well, if you're a runner, we have some information that you will want to know. With me this morning is Jessica Rootstein. She, Rootstein. she is a podiatrist with TSAOG Orthopedics. Hello. How are you doing? Good. Nice to see you. Well, good to see you. You know, I, I, I run quite a bit, you know, but from what I understand, sometimes the shoes don't fit so well. Sometimes you may have, you may not run right exactly. What, what, what are some things that uh, are most common problems, you think? The number one thing that I see is um, patients seem to be getting the wrong shoe size because they're going on their own to purchase the shoes. Yeah, now how do you make that mistake? Well, a lot of patients assume that if they wear a size 7 shoe that they also wear a size 7 sneaker and mm -hmm. um, you may go up a full size. So it's good to get professionally fit in my opinion. So uh, get professionally fit and if you're just going to go fit yourself, I guess it's better a little too loose than too tight? Uh, yeah, go at the end of the day because your foot will be a little bit swollen and that's kind of going to mimic the swelling sometimes that occurs when you uh, run. Yeah, okay. And I noticed that we've, we've got a poster here. These yes. are the common foot issues that you find with runners. Yes, sir. Um, the number one thing that I see is plantar fasciitis, which is mm -hmm. down here. And I have a little foot here. This what, 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 for those who don't know, what is plantar fasciitis? It is inflammation um, right underneath your heel. And this, this band is called the plantar fascia, and it can get inflamed if you run mm -hmm. in the wrong shoe that's too flexible for some people, um, improper fit. From, from what I understand, I've never had it, but from what I understand, it can be pretty painful. It's very painful. It feels like a stabbing pain in your heel. Well, you're not going to want to run if it feels like no, that. No, yes. Yeah, so you got to get that fixed. So that's where I come in. <laughs> okay. And, and if folks come to see you, you can maybe identify those problems before they have it. Exactly. A lot of times people will come in with bags of shoes and we'll kind of go through all their shoes and, and get them situated. Okay. Uh, arch supports can help and we also do orthotics which we have one of these right here. This is a custom orthotic and this is actually my orthotic and uh, this helps keep um, the motion control. Now for those who don't know, what is orthotics? Uh, orthotics. I, I think it has something to do with the foot. <laughs> it does. We, we cast patients feet and we make an impression um, in a mold and we can create a custom insert to go in the shoe to help with patients arch pain and heel pain. Oh really? That's okay. Really good. So maybe if somebody's flat footed. Exactly. Th then you can fix that situation. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. We do have a poster showing the one all the way to the right. What, um, what are we looking at here? What is this? Exactly? We're looking at a high arch, a, a medium arch and a low arch. And we can identify that in the clinic by watching a patient walk, taking x-rays, looking at shoes. You can see the wear on a shoe to identify what your problem is and what you need. Okay, all right. So, uh, you know, why wait until you have some pain? Ah, prevent You'd like it. for people yeah. to prevent it and come, come see in. you guys. Exactly. If you, run, if you run a lot, you know you're going to run a lot. Exactly. We've got uh, rock and roll marathons around the corner. Yeah. Oh, stress fractures. you got to watch for stress fractures. Yeah, how do you know if, uh, you just would know you've just got a pain, I guess, right? Yeah, it, a, a lot of times um, runners, they run a lot to practice getting ready and they overdo it in a shoe that's too old. So you want to replace your shoes often, you know, get a professional fit. You know, I've heard some runners tell me, you know, I like these shoes because I've worn them in. Yeah. But you're saying you may want to yeah. change them out fairly regularly. Yeah, I say about six months, six months or 500 miles. Okay, here's a question for you. Should I buy a shoe that's an off brand or a name brand? Um, I prefer the name brands. I like to have patients put money into their shoes. It's like a good tire on a car. <laughs> it's, like, it's like a good tire on a car. Yeah. Okay, well, so you, if you're a runner and you know you're going to be running a lot, why don't you go and see these folks? They'll help you out. Uh, give them a call. It's uh, TSAOG Orthop Orthopedics. You can give them a call, 210-804-5400. For more information, of course, you can just go to TSAOG.com. Again, uh, go and give them a call, and they will help you out before you have problems. That's right. <laughs> right. Hey, thanks so much for being with Thank us today. You. Okay.